Hey everybody, um, today I'm going to do a video showing y'all how to highlight your hair using a cap at home. Um, now in cosmetology school they teach you not to use a cap on hair over 10 inches long, but I've been doing it my whole life and I really like the way that it looks, so why not? So the things you're going to be needing are a cap, you can get these at Sally's, this is 99 cents, or if you have a card, oh no, it was on sale for 99 cents. But, and then it comes with the, uh, the needle in it, right there. Um, you're going to need developer. I'm using 20. Um, you can use whatever developer works for you. Um, bleach. I use Quick Blue. Um, just, yeah, I think it's the best. Um, and I get two packets. You're also going to need a toner. Well, depending on how your hair, what color your hair is, you'll need, you may or may not need a toner. I'm using um, this T10 by Wella. It's really good. I like it. And, yeah, that's pretty much all you'll need. And then you'll also need someone, if you're doing your whole head of highlights, you'll need someone to help you pull it through the cap. Because um, it's really hard to do yourself. But, um, so, yeah, so the first thing you're going to do you're going to take your brush, and this is unattractive, but um, you're going to brush your hair all back like this, straight back. And just get it all out of your face. And then you're going to take your cap, your highlighting cap. Open mine real fast. <clears throat> and you're going to slip it on your head really tight. Like that. And make sure your hair is all back. I'm just going to slip it on like this. And make sure it's really tight. Like, it's going to be uncomfortable um, because you have to tie it underneath. And it's really unattractive, but you do what you got to do. And then depending on how, um, how many highlights you want, you're going to pull through your hair through these little holes. Now you can do every other hole, you can do every hole, you know, it really just depends on what you want. Um, I'm going to do every blue hole. So yeah, so I hope you guys enjoy this video. Thanks. Okay, so this is the first part. You're going to pull the hair um, down the middle first. Um, and like I said, I'm doing every blue hole. So this is what it looks like. Now the, the, the more you pull through, the, you know, the more highlights you're going to have, of course. Um, and, uh, yeah, all you have to do is you take your little needle and you just poke it through your hole and then just pull the hair out. It's really simple. Um, and, uh, yeah, so now I'm going to do the sides and I'll show you all when it's all done. Okay, so this is what it looks like once you have everything pulled through. Um, it's all on the top and the sides. And then you're going to just, you're going to mix your bleach, um, with your developer, and it doesn't, um, with bleach, it doesn't really matter how much developer you use. Um, just get it to a consistency that you can work with. Um, because you don't want it too thick or too thin. Just whatever you feel comfortable working with. Um, some people like like a marshmallow fluff kind of consistency. So whatever works for you, and then just put it all over your hair. And depending on what uh, volume developer you're using, uh, just let it sit for that long. I'm going to be using 20 a 20 volume, so it's going to sit for about 30 minutes, um, maybe a little longer. And uh, I'll show you all what happens next. Okay, so this is what it looks like when you get all the bleach on. And uh, I'm going to let it sit for, like I said, about 30 minutes. And uh, then I'll show you all um, what happens next when we do the toner. Okay, so um, after about 30 minutes, I rinsed my bleach off, and now I have my toner on, um, which I showed you at the beginning of the video. Um, I'm using this with 20 um, just to get a little more lift on my color. Um, you can use it with 10 uh, or 20, whatever works for you. I'm going to leave this on. Hey everyone, this is my finished look. Um, as you can tell, it's a lot lighter. And the good thing about doing the cap highlighting is that it's not like big streaks in your hair. I don't like streaky. 
just, it's like an all over, it just looks lighter, as you can see. I love it. And, um, my makeup all done. Let me, I'm going to turn this light off so it doesn't look as, you can see it better. Oh, that's a lot darker. Okay, just kidding. <laughs> okay, so yeah, um, that's my finished look. I left my toner on for about 10, 10 minutes and then just rinsed it out. I used um, a purple shampoo to rinse it out and then just, um, like I used the off-brand uh, Clairol Shimmer Lights. And um, then I just used a regular shampoo after that. So one, one wash with the Clairol Shimmer Lights and then um, I used my TG Headshot um, Shampoo Conditioner. So... I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, if you have any questions about highlighting or what I did, um, just leave a comment or send me a message. And um, I hope you guys enjoyed it. Thanks for being and subscribing, you guys. Bye.